So uh, Chase, you know, Stone's out, but Christian stepped in. What did you like about his performance today? Everything. I mean, Christian's been ready every time we called on him. And uh, for him to be able to come in the game and play like that after a stretch of games, not being able to play as much, it's easier for guys in his situation to get frustrated. I know I've been in the same situation as him before, but for him to be able to come out and respond like that is amazing. So we love everything that he's doing. And uh, what, what has he shown just in practice ever since you guys have been going on? Um, a little bit of everything. Uh, he's got the mid-range game. He's got the post game. Um, He's excellent on defense, blocking shots. I think today he just snatched one right up, way, right away from a guy, and that was um, one of the best plays I've seen him do. Um, it, Christian brings a little bit of everything, everything that you could ask for in a big guy. Nico, was this a good game for everybody to get confidence back after a loss last weekend? Um, it was a really big focus for us in practice just to bounce back. Um, we were just really, really hitting hard on that, the defensive side of the ball, being able to get stops, and then uh, offensively just being able to move the ball. and. <clears throat> get it two or three sides, um, touch two or three sides of the floor. And I think we did that tonight. Everyone had got a little more confidence as the game went on. Sh shots went down. Um, Christian is just, he, he's hes unbelievable for us. He had 10 rebounds in I think 12 and a half minutes. And uh, for him to be able to come in and do that for us is going to be huge. Can you tell me the difference, you know, actually being back and practicing after last week? Yeah, I mean, going into Baylor, I'd only practiced, I think, one day before. Um, so being able to, to get a couple practices in, we had two really hard practices coming into this game, getting ready for it. And it was really good for me, um, just feeling the ball in my hands. It makes everything a little easier going into the game. You guys familiar, uh, you know, this kind of game helped you, especially with Saturday coming up and just getting that rhythm back? I mean, is it that it might apply to? Most definitely. I think it's a good uh, bounce back game for us. Uh, all credit to Omaha. Um, they were they were down a guy, but in games like this, it was really our emphasis to try to gear ourselves um, for Saturday. And the biggest way we can gear ourselves for Saturday is coming off a win like that. So, um, you know, we got two days here to to get ready and practice hard, and we got give our, give it our all against on Saturday against Gonzaga. I know you guys haven't been through film or anything yet, but Chase, I was just wondering in general, have you seen Gonzaga's? at all this year, and especially the big guys, and kind of what you think of that matchup? I'm familiar with the program, yeah. I mean, we're, we just got to play hard, and we're excited. So, uh, like I said, next two days here, get recouped and start to prepare for for the game. What kind of atmosphere are you guys expecting uh, in McHale on Saturday? I think everybody comes to Arizona playing games like this. Um, uh, it's nothing we'll shy away from. It's something we expect uh, when we come here. So, you know, we're, we're excited. and. Um, I think I speak for everybody in, in that regard. Anything else? Well, I apologize if you guys already asked, asked this earlier, but the, just the, the way you guys seem to share the ball, that seemed like a you know problem at Baylor, but a whole different deal today. I mean, was there, you know, was that a real point of emphasis to go up there? Um, I mean, yeah, just being able to touch two or three sides of the floor. If we can get a quick shot, um, we want it to be a good shot. And I think against Baylor, we had a couple that weren't good shots. Um, but that's a big emphasis for us. We want to play fast, and if we have a quick shot, we're going to take it. But if we don't, we want to get it touching two or three sides of the floor, get it inside out, and, uh, and play from there. All set? All right. Thanks, guys. You guys.